Hello everyone! In this video, I'm going to quickly guide you through our latest updates. If you're looking to optimize the work capacity of your team, we strongly advise you to start tracking time with Convention Time Tracker. First, it comes naturally to submit time right on the project board. And second, Convention now can generate timesheets where you can see the amount of time spent on each card on the board. Go to Board Settings, click Export Time Tracker Data, and in a couple of seconds, you get a brand new Google Sheet with all time submits. Feel free to play with the data and run reports. You can also upload the raw data to your internal software. Okay, how about in-app notifications? They inform you about everything that requires your attention and save time greatly. New functionality filters out notifications from other boards, letting you focus specifically on updates on the current board. And if you look through them, mark them red with just one click. The next update is for project managers and Gantt chart lovers. You told us that finish to start dependency is the most widely used one, but still sometimes you needed other types to describe the relationship between activities. Well, now you have them. Change the default finish to start dependency to either start to start, finish to finish, start to finish once by clicking on the dependency type and choosing the new one from the drop-down list. And you surely have noticed that cards on Gantt chart are now colored and wear color tags, haven't you? Finally, we implemented one more thing you asked for. Sometimes you forget to hit save when writing a card description and it gets lost. Not anymore. Convention now pre-saves all unsaved edits and you can return to editing later when clicking on the card. Same will be true for comments in the next release. That's about it. Other minor fixes and improvements you can check out in release notes. As usual, we'd love to hear from you. Drop us a line.